thought to myself, well, Harry Potter only has 12. So 550 is such a big number that I thought to myself, this has franchise all over it. There's no question about it. So as soon as I got involved, I was talking to the director of SEAF about how this is going to be a franchise. And we had many discussions on how we have to start the first film. That was a very tightrope walk that we did. And here's why. We knew, absolutely knew, that we had to please the Bangladeshi people and be authentic to the books. But we also knew that we had to introduce Masud Rana and MR9 to the world. Well, that's two different movies. And so we had to walk a very fine line of bringing just enough of the old stories and just enough of the new Hollywood to open up the story of Masud Rana to the world, but yet stay in character from the books. So we were tasked with a very big Herculean sized task of a man's entire life's work, 60 years of his books. And we didn't take that lightly. We knew that we had to represent this man and all of his work over 60 years with very kid gloves. We had to be respectful. We had to honor the Bangladeshi tradition of the story. But how do we make the story big enough and modern enough that the rest of the world will also accept MR9? So we think we did that. We're very excited. We're, we're thrilled to release it and let you be the judges on August 25th. But after this, I guarantee you, we already have written the second story. Uh, the second story is going to get right back in line with the books. And now we're going to follow more of a franchise trajectory of the story. So uh, I hope that I answered your question. Elaborate your character in this movie. Does what? Your character. Your character. My char does my character return? Of course he does. <laughs> of course, yes. So Paul Taylor has to live on. Um, and I, again, was, I was joking with uh, Asif about it, and I said, you know, I'm not sure how many of these I'll be able to do, you know, four, four of them, I would probably say. He goes, no, 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 down the road we'll make you the CIA director. I said, oh, great, I'll be around for a while. So, yes, you know, I look forward to being part of the franchise for a long time. As well, we know uh, that uh, Jackson is a blockbuster uh, cinema, blockbuster film, and what do you think? Am I mind will be blockbuster or not? Well, all, all I know is so far what I've heard as far as projections. And the projections that I hear are kind of eye-popping so far. Um, I think that it could easily break records in Bangladesh. I think it's going to do very well in India. Uh, if we could be fortunate enough to get into China and there's negotiations, maybe we could get lucky. And then in the United States, uh, it's, it seems like pre-ticket sales in advance are doing fairly well. So um, we certainly are going to go in with fingers crossed. Um, and depending on the response on ticket sales, depends how big the second story will be. Um, we're hoping for a, a really big budget for part two uh, and maybe to bring in a bigger company uh, to partner with us, possibly even Universal. So. Well, I don't know what, what the uh, uh, blockbuster term or the bar is set at to be a blockbuster here, but I think it's going to be up there with some of the biggest films that Bangladesh has ever uh, come out with. I, I think it's going to be a very big film at the box office um, just because of the numbers that I've heard told to me on what they're preparing for. Uh, so uh, we'll roll it out there and uh, certainly hope the audience responds well, but um, I think that it is going to be a very impressive box office. So does that uh, classify us as a blockbuster? Well, I certainly hope so. It deserves to be.
Yes. Have you read any of Mahaprana book or translation? I'm not read Bhagavad Gita. Have you read any translation? I personally have not because I couldn't read the books because of the translation. Uh, but I absolutely plan to. Things happened so fast for me with this particular film. Uh, they've been working on us getting the rights and shooting this film for about three to four years. I wasn't involved that long. I got involved about two months before production was to begin. And uh, I was originally getting in as an investor in the project. Um, and then they, they cast me as well. So um, because I got in late, I didn't have a chance to read the stories. And then everything since has just been lightning in a bottle. You know, we've just been moving around doing promotions and trying to finish the film up. So, but I did read parts of the second book 